An emergency meeting by government officials and donor agencies to address the humanitarian crisis in the Northeast. First, the UN Humanitarian Coordinator for Nigeria gives a picture of the humanitarian need of the IDPs in the Northeast. He says over 200,000 people are at risk of dying from malnutrition and poor Medicare unless interventions are scaled up. People similar to those who are in Bama now, who have been just re, uh, relocated by the army out of the Boko Haram areas, are more than 260,000 people, and they need urgent help now. Some of them are in a bad nutritional situation, and unless we act now, they will die. Unless we are able to scale up our response, we will see in Borno an average of five children dying every hour. For the Borno state governor, donor agencies should look beyond the suffering in the IDP camps as some returnees also face similar challenges over food and Medicare in their communities. I urge the donor community and the development partners to therefore consider the need to look beyond the IDP camps to the other people living in the host community. Meanwhile, the Minister of Health assures that the government will give priority attention to the needs of the IDPs. Let the technical people sit down. Whatever response we have with some cost, let me have it today and we can take it to the presidency. If it's not ready this evening, first thing tomorrow morning, so that we can dispatch a team to the northeast and we can start immediately. The UN says over 3 million internally displaced persons need help in the northeast. Of this number, 1.9 million are in Borno State.